Hi everybody, I'm Nancy. Welcome to my channel. Welcome to Face Mask Monday. And there's a group of wonderful ladies doing this masking every Monday. And it's just really fun to, to check each other's uh, videos out and see what kind of mask they're using and which ones they would recommend. So I am still consider myself pretty new at masking and I am terrible at trying to just get the package open so, and get it, get this on. So I did that off camera, otherwise we would have already been on here for 15 minutes while I got this figured out. But anyway, I did, uh, this one gets to stay on for about 20 minutes. So I asked my friend Alexa a few minutes ago to uh, set the timer for me. And I do have to get one of those uh, little rollers. So next time I can go out, I think my 14 days is up on Thanksgiving. So maybe, I don't know. Maybe, I don't, I don't know, the day after Thanksgiving is probably going to be crazy to go shopping, so. But I will be looking for one of those rollers. Hopefully, I will have one by next Monday. So anyway, I am using these, uh, the eye mask to the Grace and Stella. And these ones are gold, so they're really kind of cool. Very soothing when you put them on. And the mask that I am using is Dermal, the Royal Jelly. And that feels nice, other than right here. It's nice if you don't have to do this and you can just kind of lay down like this or if you had a roller that would be nice and just to kind of keep me going I've got some wine and I put it in this uh, tall glass so the straw wouldn't keep falling out because it's hard but you know what you really shouldn't brush your teeth and then go get wine yeah but anyway I've got this uh, wine haven dear garden red from Wine Haven. It's a it's a sweet wine. It's kind of dry, but it's kind of sweet at the same time. So, so I'm loving that. And I thought today, because I have been dying to um, do Touchstone Crystal, and I got this a while ago. And you've probably seen me wear wear the jewelry already quite a few times, but um, I just never got around to doing a video, and I felt really bad about it. So um, a couple of months ago, of course. Belinda, she's, uh, you know, she's took a step back, but Swarovski wasn't letting the consultants uh, quit during COVID. You know, they wanted to try to keep them going, but just, you know, a lot of people just are not buying jewelry and luxury type things like that. We're buying the necessities and things like that. But anyway, to um, keep her in spirit going, they sent her a couple of necklaces, to six necklaces um, to do for giveaways. So she did for the first six people, they would get a, a necklace. So Touchstone Crystal was also doing a promo that month. And usually it's when you spend a hundred dollars, the next item that you buy is like 30% off. So this time it was when you spent a hundred dollars, you got 50% off your next item. And then if I was one of the next first six people that placed my order, then I got a free necklace. So, you know, I jumped right on that. So anyway, if you are not familiar with Touchstone Crystal by Swarovski, um, Swarovski has been in business over a hundred years. They are just gorgeous, gorgeous crystals. You're going to see these on like uh, the Victoria's Secret models when they do their runway show. The Oscar dress gets all that bling that they put on all the dresses and the stages. It's, it's Swarovski. But anyway, the Touchstone Crystal is like a, an everyday line. It's for the average working woman or stay-at-home mom, just someone who wants some quality jewelry at a great price and something that's going to last forever. So anyway, these earrings that I got are, they were around, around the way earrings. And I got these in blush and I wear them quite a bit in the blush color. And then I also wanted the rhodium colors, but I mean, you can see they're just so pretty. And I love wearing these, they just, um, they stand out. I don't think they have too much bling. I mean, I wear them with my jeans. Okay, I wear them with my pajamas and I don't have my mirror, so I don't know if I can get this on or not, just to kind of show you how it looks. But anyway, it's good. It's a nice length. It doesn't interfere with anything. And, you know, I was afraid to wear earrings for so long and I went without wearing pierced earrings for over 20 years because I just figured I was on the phone all day and I got my phone like this and so anyway I didn't wear it and then I was going to go to an event with my bosses they were taking me uh, to uh, you know a nice event 
and I just wanted to dress up and so I got some and I was amazed I was like am I gonna have to go someplace am I gonna have to try to get the needle and do it myself with a nice cube or something but it went right in and so I have been wearing them almost every day since then and so anyway that is the first pair that I got and then um I wanted to get some more gold pieces because I wear a, a lot of silver and then every now and then I say oh I wish I had gold I wish I had gold so I got a pendant and some matching earrings and it's called do the twist so this one and it's like a twisted leaf and this one's the gold plate with the Swarovski crystals it's just really pretty it's a not a choker length but it's a little bit longer but not quite a pendant length I mean uh, yeah so so it'd be probably about this length on me and then you can always put an extender on it as well to go a little bit longer and I got the matching earrings for that one as well and I, I was just dying to wear these so I, I've worn them quite a few times without doing an unboxing to show you but um, these ones and these are all still available the necklace uh, the necklaces that they were doing for the giveaways were ones that were going to be discontinued so that's okay and um so she had two of there were six six necklaces and two of each dial and I can't get it in and uh, so out of those three I had two of them so I was hoping to be one of the first ones so that I could well you know I'm not gonna be able to get this one in oh you know do you know why it's closed duh so anyway, so I did get the one that I didn't have, so that was pretty cool. But if I had got, um, yeah, so that, that's what that one looks like. And just a, a nice length. And to me, you know, I when I first was looking at the, her catalog for the first time, I was invited to a Facebook party for this. I was like, oh, you know, this suit's fancy. I, I, I don't go any place fancy. I just go to work and I sit at home and but I there were just a few pieces that I fell in love with so I said you know what I'm gonna get them and I'm gonna wear them anyway and yeah so I did and I'm so happy that I did because I just really love the line and um this, the crystals are just so beautiful and whether I wear them with jeans or if I, I wear a dress or something like business casual or my pajamas I'm happy so anyway this is the one that was free me and it's just really really pretty so this one and this one was called the petals necklace so this one is more like a, a choker length and you know sometimes it's better not to look in the monitor but let me do it down here so you can see what it would look like but anyway and you know I, I love my touchstone crystal so we will see if Belinda decides to go back into it once things get settled down or whatever but I am glad for everything that I got and you know she was just such a wonderful consultant and was doing giveaways all the time and anyone that you know every time she had parties you know everybody that bought something their name would go into a drawing and I was just really whoops I was just really really lucky and so I, I won a lot which really helped add to my collection I did have a couple of parties that I did during like uh, double hostess awards when they had come out with a new catalog like a, the new spring line or the new fall line things like that that month is when they do um, the double hostess re rewards so so that was pretty cool getting double hostess gifts and so anyway I think I've probably got maybe 10 15 minutes left so anyway I'm just going to kind of shut this off and then come back when I after Alexa tells me to uh the timer is over and take it off and put my moisturizer on with you and um anyway so we will see you in a few minutes Alrighty, so I think I probably have a little bit of time left Alexa how much time is left on my timer? You have two minutes. 
I have two minutes and 20 seconds left. So anyway, I just came back. I've just been kind of poking this up and having sips of wine here and there. Yeah, pretty have fun. But um, I'm not sure if anybody remembers my Swarovski nutcracker that I got last year when um, when I went home for Christmas. We actually went to the Newport Mansions. We did a, a tour of four different mansions one night and it was really, really nice. And so one of the gift shops had some nutcrackers and of course I love nutcrackers and this one was actually Swarovski crystals on him he's got crystals on the top and on his crown and his clothes and even on his toes and he's got this beautiful blue cape and on his scepter so anyway I just love nutcrackers so I was so excited to get him and it was like even if he didn't fit in my suitcase I would gladly throw my clothes out and uh, to get him home. They had a couple of really cute ones and it was kind of going back and forth over which one I wanted to get and as soon as I realized that these were Swarovski crystals I'm like yep that's the one I'm buying. That's him. He was meant to be. So yeah I love having him. I think he's from Kurt. Oh. Cal Cal Holly Adler, Hollywood. But anyway, just a really, really cute. I think he adds a nice touch to my collection here. This other one that's next to him actually has um, pheasant feathers on him. And this is actually one my husband had, had got, Rick had got for me. He's got a porcelain face and he's a, he was in a hunting magazine. He was getting ready to um, go do some bird hunting and he wanted to, because you know guys, they always like to get new things when they go hunting. Not like, you know, girls like to get new clothes when we go out places or new makeup or anything like that. So anyway, he was uh, just getting some things to go hunting with and he, he saw this with the pheasant feathers and it's got some gold on it and just really, really cute. Not sure how old this one is, but Anyway, so I love that one too with a porcelain face. Alexa, shut the timer off. Alrighty, so the moment of truth. Let's see if my skin is looking young and refreshed. So again, this one was the Dermo. It was the uh, Royal Jelly. You know, it goes on nice and uh, cold, but when it comes off, it is warm. He's pretty much stayed in place and they're still really, really moist. There. Alright. Not too much left on my face. Let me see if I fit anything here I can put in. And you know, I almost grabbed one that I hadn't used before. And I was kind of trying to read the directions. And it said to leave on 10 minutes max and then wash off and not leave any residue behind and it's like weird because all the others are rub the residue into your face when you're done so I was like I don't know if I want that on my face or not where they're telling you to get it off right away all right well, my, well of course right now it's really moist because it's wet but it does feel really nice. It feels fresh. It feels hydrated. And um, I'm going to use my Lancer eye cream. And during the day I've been using, well I had a Dr. Brandt one that I had gotten maybe Fab Fit Fun last year. So I just used that up. And then I got one in a green thing. Could have been Ipsy. Could have been BoxyCharm. One of my first boxes. So I've been using that during the day. But I've been using this Lancer one at night. I really can't see any difference in my eyes, but then it's kind of like you're kind of afraid to stop because what if it's really making a difference and because you see yourself every day, you don't think there's a difference, but maybe there is. Alrighty, and my Lancer moisturizer. So anyway, that is my Monday 
mask. So I am really delighted that you joined me and I can't wait to go and check out some of the other videos. In my title, this uh, hash, hashtag thing, I, I don't know how you do the symbol, but it's a hashtag thing with, with your hands. I don't know how to do it on the typewriter. But so I'll leave that. It's Monday mask or mask ladies or something like that, but it will be in my title. So if you click on that, it should take you to everybody else that's uh, doing these mask series. So it's it's just really interesting. It's fun to see other people doing it as well, because sometimes, you know, here you are sitting without makeup on and you look kind of like, you, you know, you, you feel kind of goofy or kind of nerdy like, like me. And I can't even see myself, so that's pretty cool. So I put my glasses back on. But um, yeah, so it's just really fun to check out some of the other videos and just meeting a lot of nice ladies. And it's just a lot of fun. So if you want to join in the fun with Mondays, um, and it doesn't even have to be Monday. We just kind of post it on Monday. So whenever you can, and with that hashtag, whatever thing, we'll find you. So anyway, thanks everyone for joining me. I hope you give this video a thumbs up. Your comments, of course, are always welcome. And we will chat again soon. Bye-bye, everyone.